reporting live from J and Equipment. Today I just want to shoot a uh, quick product demonstration on one of my new surfactants, Citrus Mask. As a lot of you know online, I just released a new line of soft wash chemicals. I've been getting a lot of questions uh, via email and um, kind of phone calls into the shop also. A lot of people out there um, not really sure what to expect out of it, so I wanted to shoot a demonstration to show you in real time what's going to happen. So um, what I've got today is I've got a mixture of 70% water, 30% bleach, and then I've used a uh, appropriate mix of my masking agent, Citrus Mask. Um, my two most popular masking agents right now are my Lemon Mask and my Citrus Mask. The one I'm going to show you today is my normal foam. The Lemon Mask actually has a higher foam. The Citrus Mask, I call it like a normal foam action. And I just want to kind of show you what to expect and what's going to happen with these things. So what we're really looking for and what we're getting out of this product is it's going to create a foam, letting us know what we're spraying. It's going to slow down how quickly the product runs down the wall or the roof. And also it's going to mask the scent of the SH in my mix. Obviously in the video, we're not going to know if the odor's masked, but at least we can see the sudding action. And then we can also see how fast or slow my material is going to run off my roof. And um, I'll actually spray it with material first. We'll talk about it and then I'll hit it with water. And you can see how fast the water runs off too, just so we can see the difference. So um, I'm actually using a special mix today. I have a new product that I'm about to release. It's called the Stealth Mad Batcher Pro. Um, pretty much it's pre-mixing everything for me. I don't have to mix at home. I just have all my individual components, bleach, water, and surfactant. I set my knobs and go. Pretty similar products out there in the market. You should be familiar with it. The only difference is mine's not gonna cost you an arm and a leg and it's gonna work just as well. So let's go ahead and get into the demonstration. So as you can see, we got some nice sudding action here coming from our citrus mass. And you can also notice how some of the bubbles now are really starting to suspend. And as this spreads out, more and more bubbles are gonna suspend here on the wall. One thing I wanna mention to you guys, this is 100% vertical drop. Uh, these are situated, you know, so even in a complete vertical drop situation, you could see how the surfactant is helping it just really stick to the wall. So it's giving it some nice gripping action. It's really suspending the material to the wall. And why is this important? Two things that this is really doing for us. So number one, the surfactant, not only does it cause bubbles, it's breaking water tension. I went over this in another video. When you break water tension, it, or surface tension of the water, it helps the water get deeper into these cracks and crevices to really clean down in there. You know what's down in there? Your mold and mildew spores. They're down in there. What we see is on the surface, but what we're trying to clean, it's really down in there. And while it's suspended, it's giving the bleach a, tra a chance to react on the surface. It's not reacting up in the air, it's not running off the roof and reacting down with the plants, it's staying on the surface. Throughout this video, you're really starting to notice here how much this is really suspending. The runoff has almost completely stopped at this point. We have completely suspended our product here. And the great part about this product and with my new Mad Batcher system is you could control this. Uh, you know, if you want it to be even more sticky, you would turn it up. If you're saying, you know, I don't want it to stick this much, you would just turn it down. You'd still get a little bit of low foam, but it wouldn't stick so much. Um, this is pretty much something I wanted to show people. Um, if a lot of your materials is running straight off the roof and you're noticing you're killing a lot of foliage, a product like this is gonna help you substantially. We're reducing the runoff. We're reducing how much product is getting wasted by just running off the roof, running down the gutters and getting down into the plants. You know, and that's kind of the whole gist of this product. It's doing three main things for you. Number one, foaming action, helping it stay on the wall. While it's on the wall, it's helping it break the surface tension and clean down in those cracks and crevices because now the bleach is actually on the surface, not just running off. It's staying on the surface and reacting there. And the third thing it's doing for you, which you can't tell in the video, is it's masking the scent. And those are the three things our lemon mask and bleach mask are factor going to do for you. 
If you have any questions, don't hesitate to leave me a comment, email, or phone it in. Thanks a lot.